Hi, I'm Jake Trussell, the creative director here at World Business Chicago, and I want to tell you about a project we've been working on called Site Selector. It's a web-based mapping tool to help you find the best possible location for your business in the city of Chicago. Let me show you how it works. Site Selector is located at worldbusinesschicago.com slash site selector. Upon arriving at the site, you'll see a map on the right and a list of items that can be toggled on or off on the map on the left. Say you're an industrial company. You know that you're looking to locate in an industrial corridor. You can turn that layer on here and you can see where the industrial corridors are in the city. You know that you also want to be around colleges and universities. Well, you can turn that layer on here. And you start to get a feel for which parts of the city have industrial corridors and a nearby college or university. And you can see the names of those colleges or universities by clicking on them here, as well as the name of the industrial corridors. Say you also know that you want to be in an enterprise zone. Toggle that layer on. Then you can see, well, there are enterprise zones that overlap with certain industrial corridors and universities. This starts to show you the power of the tool. Now, we have this broken down into two sections. This top section here are incentive programs that may be available to your company. And then the bottom section are other amenities and different things that can be layered on the map, including even bike routes and arts and entertainment. So under incentive programs, each of these programs that are available can be filtered by your business type. So let's say your company is small, you only have 15 employees, so 0 to 25 employees, uh, you're looking for office space, filter, you get back a narrowed down list of which incentives are available. Now you'll see here there are two mappable incentive programs. There are also non-mappable incentive programs. It looks like there are 19 of them. You can open this up and see all 19 and each of these programs has its own page where you can get more detailed information about that program. The other thing that you may want to do is you may already have an address in mind. So you could enter an address here. And it'll show you that location on the map and then you can start layering things on and see what's available in that area. Now, let's say I want to find some uh, office space. I hit available office or R&D space, and it looks like there are a few things right around this location. This one looks good. So if I want more info, I can click here. Now we've partnered with a company called Rofo.com. It's a web-based commercial real estate company, and you can go to their site and see much more information about each of the properties that we have listed on our site. Another interesting real estate piece is that we have um, city-owned non-residential land. The city of Chicago owns land, which they may or may not be looking to lease or sell to you. And uh, all the info about who to contact is here, and you can see uh, where all those properties are located. Are they in an enterprise zone? Let's see. Yep, there are some. So that gives you an idea of how Site Selector works in a nutshell. We're really excited about Site Selector, but we know it's not perfect. So we want your feedback. Please let us know what you like, what you don't like, or if you have any questions. Thanks for watching.